February 14th, St. Valentine, Priest and Martyr. Valentine was a holy priest in Rome who assisted the martyrs during the persecution under Claudius II. His great virtue and influence became known, and he was apprehended and brought before the emperor's tribunal. Why, Valentine, do you want to be the friend of our enemies and reject our friendship? The Christian priest replied, My lord, if you only knew the gift of God, you would be happy and your empire with you. You would reject the cult of your idols and would adore the true God and his son jesus christ one of the judges interrupted asking the martyr what he thought of jupiter and mercury he said that they were miserable and they spent all their lives in debauchery and crime the judge furious cried he has blasphemed against the gods and against the empire the emperor none the less continued his questioning with curiosity pleased to have this opportunity to know what christians thought valentine had the courage to exhort him to do penance for the blood of the christians which had been shed to believe in jesus christ be baptized and then you will be saved he said and already in this life you will ensure your empire's glory and the triumph of your arms claudius began to be convinced and said to those in attendance hear the beautiful doctrine this man is teaching us but the prefect of rome dissatisfied cried out see how this christian is seducing our prince claudius weakening abandon the holy priest to another judge this man was named asterius he had a little girl who had been blind for two years hearing of jesus christ the light of the world he asked valentine if he could convey that light to his child saint valentine placed his hands on her eyes and prayed lord jesus christ true light illuminate this blind child the child saw and the judge with his family confessed christ and received baptism the emperor hearing of this would have turned his gaze away from these conversions but fear caused him to betray his sense of justice with several other christians saint valentine was tortured and martyred in the year 268 the illustrious martyr has always been held in great honor in rome where there still exists a catacomb named for him another legend around saint valentine was based on the norm of catholic marriage polygamy was the norm in ancient rome and to make matters worse the emperor issued an edict that prohibited the marriage of young people this was based on the hypothesis that unmarried soldiers fought better than married soldiers because the married soldiers might be afraid of what might happen to their wives or families if they died saint valentine took that edict as a challenge he made it his own personal mission to share the catholic vision of marriage and the graces of the sacrament with all those who would listen he would go one step further he would secretly marry as many couples as possible this might have been what led to saint valentine's initial capture and torture before claudius the second a final note around saint valentine it is said that the last note that he wrote was to asterius's daughter and that it inspired the romantic missives of today because he signed it from your valentine what does it really mean to be a valentine simply this that there comes a time when you have to lay your life on the line for what you believe and with the power of the holy ghost we can do that just like saint valentine